Is impacting air travel as the 4th of July holiday approaches with thousands of flight delays continuing to be a problem across the country. As we enter the post pandemic era, Bradley International Airport is giving travelers advice ahead of what is expected to be a busy week in summer ahead. Western Mass News reporter Glenn Kittle now joins us live at Bradley with more details. Glenn. Yeah, that's right. There was a lot of delays this weekend here at Bradley International Airport and cancellations. Now, Bradley International Airport officials are giving people advice as we get into those busy summer months. Millions of travelers are expected to choose to fly to their summer vacation spots in 2023. Manager of Marketing for Bradley International Airport, Alyssa Sissick, tells Western Mass News how they're gearing up for the busy summer travel. So between now and next week, we're expecting about 50,000 individuals to depart here at Bradley International Airport. Naturally, it's an exciting time. It's summer travel is here. Uh, and we just want to make sure that individuals traveling come to the airport prepared so that they can ensure that their, smooth, their journey is smooth and easy. TSA New England spokesman Dan Velez tells Western Mass News being ready before you get to the airport is key to avoiding the typical long lines at the security check-in. Yeah, one of the best uh, pieces of advice that we can give travelers is to make sure that when you first start packing, you start with an empty suitcase. You never know what you had in it from a previous trip. Bradley International Airport is also implementing new technology to keep lines as short as possible. With our new technology is when folks come up to the travel document checker, all they need is their ID card. They don't need the boarding pass uh, in most cases anymore. It's the ID card. If you have that out, that helps expedite the process as well. They're also asking folks to be aware of what they can't bring on a flight. Velez says obviously a knife, a nightstick, or even a brick is not allowed in your luggage. However, he tells us one item that seems safe to bring on a flight could hold you up in security. Believe it or not, water is the biggest uh, prohibited item that we see come through. We do have on TSA.gov on our travel section and of course on our TSA app, we have a what can I bring portion of that app. And it's pretty cool because you can type anything you can think of and it'll tell you whether you can check it uh, or if you can bring it in your carry on bag. Now, with those widespread cancellations and delays over this 4th of July weekend, Bradley International Airport officials are asking flyers to keep a mind on the weather at your destination. Say while the weather here in Connecticut may be favorable for flying, the weather at your destination may not be. Reporting live at Bradley International Airport, Glenn Kittle, Western Mass News.